Welcome. Your healthcare provider has prescribed Philips Mobile Cardiac Telemetry, MCOT, as a diagnostic tool. The MCOT system conducts a beat-by-beat -beat analysis of your heart activity and transmits certain abnormal heartbeat recordings to Philips cardiac technicians. Our cardiac technicians monitor ECG data and look for specific heart activity 24 hours a day, seven days a week, and in some cases may contact your healthcare provider. Clinical reports are made available to your healthcare provider to review during and at the end of your service. This video will help you get started with your monitoring service, explain how to record an event, and provide some tips to help you successfully complete your monitoring service. As this video guides you through the entire process, we encourage you to take your time and pause this video at certain points to ensure you have completed each step of the process properly. Before getting started, open your MCOT Flex Adapter Kit, remove box one, and open it. Note, if you are transitioning to the MCOT Flex from the patch and your monitoring has already started, you will complete all steps in this video except the monitor setup process. Before you begin the setup process, it is important to understand that MCOT is not an emergency response system. It is a diagnostic test. The monitor cannot be used to make outgoing calls, even during an emergency. It is important to properly prepare your skin before starting the setup process. To assist you, please carefully watch all steps before beginning to prep the skin yourself. Your first step is to prepare the left side of your chest. If you have hair on the left side of your chest, you will want to remove it. Shave hair using a razor. Wash the area with soap and water and fully dry the area shown in the circle. Do not apply lotions or oils. Take this time to pause the video and prepare your chest. Remove the flex adapter and MCOT sensor from box one. Slide the sensor firmly into the flex adapter. A green light will flash, indicating the sensor is working. If a red light appears, call patient services at 1-866-426-4401. Remove two electrodes from the electrode pouch. The electrodes are located in box two. Leave the plastic backings on. While the electrode is still on the plastic backing, snap it to the back of the flex adapter as shown. Repeat this step by snapping the second electrode onto the back of the flex adapter arm. Remove the plastic backing strips from the electrodes. Be careful not to touch the adhesive. Place the flex adapter in the center of your chest, approximately three finger widths below your collarbone. Do not place too low or this may impact the quality of the signal. Press the second electrode firmly so that the arm lays flat against your chest. Now we will set up the monitor. Locate the monitor in box one. The monitor is an important part of the MCOT system as it transmits that data from your heart to the cardiac technicians at Philips. To turn on the monitor, press and hold the power button. Follow the on-screen guidance to complete the setup. Select a language to continue. When you see this screen, press Continue. You are now greeted by the welcome screen on the monitor. Select Next and verify your identification. If the name that appears on the screen is yours, press Yes. If the name that appears on the screen is not yours, please contact Patient Services toll-free at 1-866-426-4401 for assistance. Next, you will be prompted to accept the terms and conditions of the service agreement. Additionally, you will be asked to agree or disagree with the data terms in order to begin your service. The Wear and Care screen will guide you with helpful tips during your MCOT service. Continue completing the setup process. When you see this screen, you completed the setup process. Congratulations!
The remainder of this video will review the information you need to know while monitoring, including how to record a heart-related symptom, change electrodes, and return the equipment at the end of service. Record events. While MCOT monitors your heart and sends data automatically to Philips ECG solutions, you can also record symptoms as you feel them and if you took a medication. To record an event, press Touch to Record Event on the main monitor screen. Then select the symptom or symptoms you were feeling and if you took any medication. Select all that may apply. Select Next to continue. To record your level of activity when the symptom occurred, select Done. The Event Recorded screen confirms that your symptom was recorded. Press OK to return to the home screen. MCOT worn with the Flex Adapter is not water resistant. Remove before showering, bathing, or swimming. Although you must remove the MCOT Flex Adapter before showering, you can shower with the electrodes. It is recommended that you change your electrodes every 48 hours or after showering, whichever comes first. Follow these steps to ensure an easy transition when removing old electrodes and attaching new ones. First, turn off the monitor. Then, unsnap the flex adapter from the electrodes. Now that the flex adapter is off your chest, remove the sensor from the flex adapter. Next, use soap and water to gently remove the electrodes from your skin and then discard the electrodes. If you are showering, shower as you normally would. When it is time to apply new electrodes, dry your skin thoroughly and follow the setup instructions in this video to put the flex adapter and electrodes back on your chest to continue monitoring. If mild itching or irritation underneath the electrodes occurs, it is usually temporary. If more significant itching or irritation develops or persists, contact patient services at 1-866-426-4401. They may direct you to contact your physician. You will receive an alert on the monitor when it is time to charge the sensor. Locate the charger and cable wire and connect the sensor to the charger. Charging may take up to 90 minutes and is complete when the light turns solid green. Alerts on your monitor let you know if an action is needed. Therefore, it is important to promptly address all alerts on your monitor and keep the monitor near you at all times. When the battery on your monitor is low, use the supplied charger. The monitor will show a warning message when the battery is low. Record any events or symptoms you may feel. If instructed by your physician, record when you took medication. When your monitoring service is complete, a message will appear on the monitor to return the equipment. Place the sensor, monitor, chargers, and any unopened electrode pouches into the Philips kit. Place your packed kit into the prepaid shipping envelope provided with your kit and ship it back to Philips. There is no cost to you to mail back the equipment. It is important to return all MCOT equipment promptly to avoid charges. The MCOT device and kit components are the property of Philips and failure to return them may result in a bill for the cost of the equipment. For additional assistance, refer to the patient education guide in your kit or contact patient services at 1-866-426-4401. Innovation and you, Philips.